Nigga brides in Atlanta Just to the lean in the family Credit cards in the scammers Hitting the licks in the van Legacies, family Way and see, look like a panda Coming up next It's a UFC featherweight division fight excited for this one. This is a kickboxer of the highest order. He has so many different kicks and punches in his arsenal and figures to try to keep this on the feet here tonight. The beautiful thing that he does is throws that front push kick to create distance when a guy starts to get too close and wants to wrestle with him. He throws it and the moment you're back at his range, he starts to blast high kicks. He doesn't always intend on landing him, but he beats up your arms with high kick after high kick after high kick. And as you get desperate, you start to run into these, and he does not need much space to land a knockout punch. This guy is one of the best strikers we've ever seen in the UFC. And if you don't find the striking range early against this guy, you could be in real trouble. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique, because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Our tail of the take now for this featherweight fight. Both fighters are 31. With some differences in height, but big differences in reach. All right, to get us started now, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, a referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. It's reducing first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 136 pounds. Fighting out of New York, New York, Jumbo! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. Official home base team over the ring here in Las Vegas, Nevada, and 18,000 plus are expected on hand tonight for what should be an epic UFC live event. It is going to be a phenomenal fight night in a fantastic arena. T-Mobile Arena, the home of the UFC. Oh, beautiful jab by him there, really taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Ooh, looking to set up that head kick. Just out of range with that kick attempt. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Nice. 
big clutch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Trying to do damage now with the kick. That's a miss. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, just misses. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Beautiful punch. Just over three minutes to go in our first round. Try to establish that jab. Big kick. Under three minutes now to go in round one. Missed with that right hand. Oh, a huge block there. Effective punch there by Lee. Left hand is true, that will absolutely work. He throws it like a pistol back and forth. He's landing that beautiful left hand. He's gotta be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Lee's kick locked. Changes his stance. Nice punch there. Big power shot there. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Liver kick. Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. Well, we told you off the top he had the reach advantage, and you saw it right there with that punch. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Just out of range with that left hook. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Look at him whip his hips into that kick. Blocks that strike. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Just out of the range with that right hand. Good punch land. Twenty seconds left. All right, here final seconds of round one. Just misses there with the left. Huh. A lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right? kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. 
beautiful strike. Kick to the body by Lee. The right hook to the body. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Put those knees on it. Nice kick. Another shot lands upstairs. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Big punch land. Ooh. Well, he's got the longer reach, and he certainly showed it there in landing that straight punch. That was a thudded leg kick. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Real nice body kick lands. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh, and a nice jab by him there, and that's gonna give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Nice leg kick. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. He is going after that overhand right. Nice body kick. Oh, is that a big knee? The body will see if he can follow up. Oh, body kick attempt here. It's no good. Lee's kick attempt. That one was blocked. <laughs> Trying to land the elbow there to no avail. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Ooh, big shot lands. Push kick there to the body. certainly making good use of what is an obvious edge in reach. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Well, he continues to offer up the kick here, but just misses with that one. Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Oh, that'll ring your bell. Head kick. That's a big strike right there. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Oh, wow. he, lands, he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. What a fight so far. All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned. A huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward.
I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight. Another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. As he gets close and he's out of the kicking range, he'll, suddenly, he'll change his stance. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. So once again, leaning on that long reach as he counters effectively with a jab to the head. improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Nice punch by Lee. Oh, he got that knee to connect to the body, and if you're the defensive fighter here, you got to make sure you don't eat too many more of those. You cannot eat too many. You got to get the elbows inside, and otherwise, you're going to land one that's going to shut everything down. And he landed the right hand there. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Three minutes remain in the round. Blocks the shot to the body. Nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Misses with the right hand. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Trying to establish that jab once again. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Get out of there. Doubling up on the jab. Lee going with the kick to the body, but unable to find the range. Big kick lands. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? A swing and a miss by Lee. Beautiful leg kick thrown. Nice one, two there. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Big punch lands. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. Be out. 
Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. All right, let's get you a replay from that previous round. It was the big knockdown courtesy of that kick that, that nearly closed the show for good. It almost closed the show, but nothing's more discouraging than when you get somebody hurt that bad and you don't shut the door. He has to go back to work now knowing that he's got about as tough a guy as, he, as he's ever had in front of him in the octagon tonight. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Lee's kick to the body is blocked. Nice straight punch. Miss with the left there. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, just misses with the kick. Wow, what a kick! Fight's gonna be over what a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his corner button going low. And now he's got to hurt very badly. Big kick lands. Now going upstairs with the left hook. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Nice head kick. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Just missed with that right hand. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Well, the body work starting to take its toll. Look at the redness starting to appear on his left side. Whoa! That is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot land. And just like that, the fight is over. Holy smokes! <laughs> yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. All right, let's re-rack the highlight now, DC. And he's certainly going to enjoy watching this one back. The head kick was there early, it was there often, and ultimately ended the night for his opponent. He found a weakness in his opponent's game. The left kick, over and over, he was able to land it. And he was landing the strikes, too, with his hands. But ultimately, it was the kick that was hidden behind the punch that finished the fight for him. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 30 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee! And there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoyed the birth of your kids, right? Yeah. But you knock out a man in a cage fight, I can't think of anything better. I mean, there's nothing like it. You know, you don't even hear the one that lands, that puts out your opponent's lights. And tonight, he got that done.